talk to you today about how to make time to study and why it's important as well. The whole point of going to school is to get the career choice you want. It's not to just go to school and just because you have to. No one's telling you you have to anymore at least. So you go to school to get the career choice you want. To how to make time to study, it's, hard, it's kind of hard for me to say because I'm in the same group as you guys. Sometimes I'm too busy to, sometimes I'm not. But some good ways to make time is to not hang out with your friends as much. If you hang out with your friends for, let's say, four hours, let's try to narrow it down to two hours and see what that two extra hours does for you if you take out a book and you start studying for your next subject. Also, TV and video games. Now, I can't stress this enough because I sit in front of the TV and I can sit there for a couple of hours without even noticing the time and how much time has gone by. But TV and video games, I know that if you also, if you play for like an hour and a half, try to subtract or play for a half hour, see if that extra hour will do for you because I promise you will get a better grade. And I know that. Also, less distracting. Go to a less distracting place. I have five brothers and sisters. I live with my stepdad and also his girlfriend. So the house is always loud. We always have friends and other family members coming in and out. It's really hard to actually sit down, even in my own room, to sit down and study. So me personally, when it gets like nicer out, I like to go to like the park or the beach, anywhere really that's quiet and I can just focus. Now, from experience, I work 8 to 11 hours a day, 5 days a week, and not every shift is 11 hours, sometimes I do get out in 8 hours, but I do know that working and going to school makes it 10 times harder to sit down and study, because when you're out of, school, out of work, you want to go out with your friends when you're not in work or school. But for me, I know from going from high school to college, high school I was about a C average student, wasn't doing well at all, didn't care to. I didn't work as much, but um, I noticed that going from high school to college when I got here, I had no choice but to open up a book and study. I had to. And I noticed that my grades improved from a C to an A plus student. Um, some people in here probably think they don't need to study. They probably have better grades. They're an A student just like I said I was. So why should I have to study if I'm a new student? Well, it's not that you don't need to study, you just don't need to study as hard as others. Everyone needs to study. It's like for your own like, behalf. You're, you'll do better on your own. You'll feel better. You will improve your knowledge as an individual. You will also have better grades, test scores. You will get the career you wanted, you picked out. And you will also have more knowledge. If you don't do this, you'll have poor grades, low tests, quiz average, hard to get the career you want, and the less knowledge you will know as an individual. Thank you for listening, and I hope you have a better understanding on why studying is important and how to make time for it as well.